Yo, what's up guys? In this video, I'm going to be covering five of the new best pro tips and tricks that you need to be using in Fortnite Season 7. This is going to be covering some of the new weapons you need to be abusing and also just things about the, the new map and changes like that. If you do find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. But also remember, let me know what you think about the new season down in the comments section. Now let's get right into this video. Okay, so for trick number one, I'm going to teach you how you can get the new railgun and the new scanner gun all at one time. So what you want to do is you want to land at these new alien outposts with the giant red beacons at the top of them. And then you want to go down and you want to find the new henchman chest. The henchman chests are typically under stairs or under slanted roofs. But after you go and open one of them, you can either get a blue pump, a rail gun, the new pulse rifle, or you can get the sonar gun. If you get the sonar, sonar gun, go ahead and shoot it, and it will show you where all the new chests are and everything like that. So go ahead and shoot it as soon as you get it. It also will tell you if an enemy is sneaking up on you. So it's super broken in the off spawn. So what you want to do is just spam it as much as possible because it does regenerate ammo and it doesn't cost you anything so spam it as soon as you can and then use that to uh, win off spawn Okay, so trick number two is how to W key using the new scanner gun. What you want to do is you want to shoot it as much as possible whenever you're in a fight. This will allow you to see your enemies through any wall and as long as they stay in the range of like the actual the circle, then you will always know where they're at. But make sure that you're always constantly shooting them because the things only last for 15 seconds. So if you heal for a long time, make sure that you shoot it as soon as you're done healing. Right here in this fight, I used the, the radar gun while I was shooting. I went ahead and I shot it, and then I saw my enemy was going to drop down on my wall, so I tracked him until I saw an opening that I could actually shoot him, and as soon as I got an opening, I went ahead and took a shot on him and hit him for 100 plus damage, and that allowed me to win this fight. So using the new radar guns when fighting an arena is so important because it just it just makes fighting so much easier. So make sure you use this. Okay, so trick number three is how to use the new rail gun. So what you want to do is you want to either use a scanner gun so that you know where your enemy is so that you can shoot through the wall or you want to just try to track them yourself. It's really not that hard to see enemies through builds and as soon as you do see them, you can go ahead and shoot them right to the wall. Most of the time they won't be expecting it and this will give you about 100 more damage on your opponent to go ahead and push a fight. Okay, so trick number four is a pretty cool one and I'm pretty happy the Epic actually added it. It's a new crafting feature. So with the new crafting feature, you can change attack shotgun or pump shotgun into a lever shotgun. You can change a heavy AK or a normal AK or a normal assault rifle into a burst assault rifle and that's about it actually so what you want to do is you want to go ahead and find these nuts and bolts around the actual map and this is really good when you have like a purple or gold ak because then you can side grade it to an aug and everybody knows these augs are disgusting so make sure that if you ever do have something like this you have the fact that you can side grade them Okay, so for the fifth trick is actually something new epic added. You can now buy shields and sometimes weapons from NPCs using gold. There's also new vending machines they added as well that allow you to buy weapons and shield with gold too. So if you ever do see an NPC or a vending machine, make sure to check them out because you might be able to buy something pretty useful. Okay, so for an extra bonus trick, I'm just going to let you know that both deagles and snipers have been added back into the game. Snipers allow you to still one-shot your enemy, which is, in my opinion, not fair at all. I don't believe that a one-shot should be able to end your game in any way possible, but they did add them back, so make sure you are using them if you can, because hitting a headshot snipe, it's really not that hard, and it will give you an instant refresh. And then also, deagles are super good just for the all around damage like 75 damage is so good and then they're also really good at applying pressure and for you high ping players taking walls is super easy with a deagle because you can like fake out and then you can just shoot a wall and somebody's not holding it and it allows you to take it first try so make sure you're using both of those new weapons in the new season 
all right guys so that is going to wrap up this tips and tricks video if you did find it helpful make sure to like and subscribe also leave a comment letting me know how much you like this new season i'm loving it so expect a lot of videos uh straight up for this video and season but if you have any video ideas let me know down in the comment section thanks for watching to the end of the video god bless and take care